What's up guys, this is Pro Warriors. The PlayStation Portable PSP was the most popular handheld console if you miss playing your favorite PSP games such as Lumines, Metal Gear Solid, Tekken, Final Fantasy then don't worry as you can still enjoy these games using your computer. All you need to do is to set up PPSSP emulator. In this video we are going to learn how to play any PlayStation games on a PC and laptop by PC. PSSP emulator guys I'm not kidding and this is definitely not a clickbait you can see I'm playing PSP games on my computer for your kind information PPSSP is completely free to use emulator with high definition and 60 FPS PPSSP is available on Windows Linux and Mac operating system in this video I'm going to guide you how to set up the PPSSP emulator settings and best configuration control customization and how to install ROMs on the PPSSP emulator. It's a complete tutorial, so watch the full video carefully. Please like and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell button. At first, we will download the PPSSP emulator on our computer. So open the browser on your PC or laptop, then type on the URL bar pppsspp.org. I will leave the link in the description. Let's go ahead and head over to the link, then click on the download button. On the download page, you can find the download option for the various operating system. You can see that PPSSP is available on Android, Windows, and Mac OS, as well as Linux operating system. Its current version is 1.17.1. Better to be mentioned that PPSSP has two different versions and I would like to recommend the blue one which is 100% free and has no ads. The second one is PPSSP Gold which is a paid version. I used both versions. There is no difference. So download the emulator according to your operating system. I'm going to install it on my Windows machine. You can see we can download this software in different methods you can try PPSSP installer or zip file portable but zip file is a little bit complicated that's why I'm going to select the PPSSP installer just to click on it the size of the file is just 21 megabyte and it will immediately start downloading the exe file once the download finishes double click on the package installer select the language you prefer to use then click on the install button it will ask you for the storage location where I would like to install this application so it must be installing in the C drive when it's done uncheck the readme text and leave PPSSP checked then click on finish button so guys now we are inside the PPSSP emulator and you will be greeted with this screen if you already used the PPSSP emulator on your smartphone then you will notice that the PC version also looks like the same on the left side of the screen all games will be displayed on the right side and top board there are other options and settings even though we have launched the PPSSP software for the first time the game library will be empty before we install and start playing any games check out the settings menu because there are lots of different settings and therefore a lots of customization which will help us to ensure the best experience let me go full screen first open the settings option of PPSSP emulator under the section of graphics you can see backend option which is the default selection of direct 3d you can also change it to OpenGL or Vulkan it can be very machine to machine and game to game I suggest you to use all the renderers to identify the best one for you now for the display resolution you must try the native display resolution to avoid unwanted crashes if your computer is is highly configured you can go up to 10x or 8x which is 4k if you notice that the game is struggling to run then come back and turn this down to 4x PSP which is equal to 1080p resolution make sure vsync is checked 
I recommend turning on auto frame skip option for the smoothest gameplay possible. At the bottom of the page, you will find show FPS count and show speed option. If you want to see live FPS and CPU information during gameplay, just turn on this option. One of my favorite feature of this software is the control menu. Because there is a lot to do here, just click on control mapping. It's better to be mentioned that the default control method is set to keyboard. If if you want to change the keys, just put your desired keys in the controls. But I found the default keys to be perfect. If you have an external controller, you can also use it on BPSSP emulator. And the audio menu, just leave it as default. I'm moving into the system menu. There are lots of options, but I don't think you need to change anything here. Don't be afraid. There is an option to restore BPSSP settings to default. Now let's load games on. PPSSP emulator. It's better to be mentioned that PPSSP also provides some demo games. Just click on the homebrew and demos button at the top bar. Now click on the PPSSP homebrew store. There are a few PPSSP games available. These games are not interesting and I don't think none of you will like to play them. So we will download our favorite PSP games and install them manually. Switch to the games option at the top bar. Then open browse folder. It will open your file explorer and navigate to the folder where you have stored PPSSP games. You can see I have already downloaded some PSP ROM. Wait a minute. Now you might be wondering where I get these games and which games you should download. PPSSP has released a compatibility game list on their website. I have given the link in the description. From this list you can get thousands of games that are playable in the PPSSP emulator. Another common question is which website do I use to download PSP ROM? It's very simple. Select game from the compatibility list then open your chrome browser then write the game name then write psp roms psp is the format name i think now you can easily download games there are several sources for that unfortunately i can share any direct link here please join our discord server for more information one more important thing after downloading any roms it might be in a gif format so first you have to unzip or extract it then move the psp rom to the game folder if you are still confused regarding the game selection so i made a list please see the game list on the screen these games are currently playable on the PPSSP emulator now it's time to launch a game and get experience how this emulator can run psp games on our computer guys you can see i'm running tracking 6 on the ppssp emulator so this is how it looks if you are running at 4x resolution if you increase the resolution the quality of the video will increase i'm getting full speed and 60 frame per second which is an awful performance i would like to recommend everyone please try ppssp emulator because it's free and full of features that ensure a psp gaming experience on your pc and laptop please like and subscribe to our channel no more today see you in the next video take care